okay then we go to the oropharynx in oropharynx we will see palatine tonsils when we are doing oropharynx we will understand that okay and what else you can see in the nasopharynx try to pull this what is this portion this is the soft palate hard palate soft palate okay so from the hard palate and soft palate you will see that there are two folds of mucosal membranes okay when i pull the tongue down you can see two folds here what are the two folds let's see that this one from the palate to the tongue okay and palate to the pharynx right this one. you can see that can you see that so this is called as palatoglossal arch and palatopharyngeal arch okay in that we have palatoglossus muscle and palatopharyngeus muscle between these two we have palatine tonsil this depression is called as tonsillar fossa inside that palatine tonsils are present so this here in this depression we have palatine tonsil so one on each side so we studied about nasopharyngeal tonsil here tubal tonsil here on both sides here we'll see palatine tonsil one on each side and finally at the bottom to complete the circle we have lingual tonsil now see the lingual tonsil this is the tongue anterior two thirds of the tongue and posterior one third of the tongue on the posterior one third of the tongue you will see lot of lymphatic nodules elevations that's a rough elevation you can see that so only anterior two thirds is smoother velvety appearance whereas posterior one third we will see lot of lymphatic nodules this is called as lingual tonsil so we complete waldeyer's lymphatic ring okay top nasopharyngeal on both sides tubal tonsils and below palatine tonsils and at the bottom lingual tonsil that completes waldeyer's lymphatic ring okay